of it. Hello, gents. Hello. You all right? Hey, Phil. Thanks for coming. Yeah. Um, well, this is kind of your time, I guess. What's that, sorry? It's kind of your time. Oh. <laughs> um, I thought this was obviously um, Alan and Debbie are here, so. Yeah, thank you. Thanks for coming. Uh, we've we've talked about it on the way here about I mean I'm I'm kind of guessing what you want to talk about but I'm guessing it's related back to the fact that I did an interview with Mark the other day. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's good. That's good. That's good. Do you just want to? Yeah, I mean. Just keep going for me. Go. I guess it kind of is. I don't really want to. Is that okay then? Um, I actually don't want to talk about him. Okay. Today. I'm kind of happy that, um, <laughs> about that. I said everything I need to say about that guy. Um, I, I just want to talk about the last month, my injuries, things that have happened, sure. and where that puts me with progress wrestling, I suppose. Okay, so you're, again, pe I guess people don't know this, but like, you're due March 5th? 5th for surgery. Uh, some people know. Um, I announced it last Monday that, that, that I was due for surgery. Same day, same day Mark got, a, got announced for Super Strong Style. It's okay. a coincidence, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I mean, I announced my surgery. Like, let's lay like, the whole timeline down. I was injured uh, January 13th on a show, wrestling. Um, spent the last month sort of in and out of doctors surgery uh, scans and, and the rest of it. Mm -hmm. um, I'm at a point now where I'm kind of just playing a waiting game, waiting for surgery, but uh, the, the tear itself will will require some extensive rehab once it's reattached. How long? Mm, the doctor says three months back to sports, but obviously what we well, do yeah. maybe not. Possibly a little bit more complex than... sport, so I think it's three months to return to starting to practice so that you could wrestle. Sure. So maybe four, which I guess brings you to like July. I kind of, I kind of did. Mm. I target June or July. Okay. As we stand at the moment. But, um... So, I'm guessing that... I mean, it sucks, right? Because the thing is, you know that I was booked for Strong Style too. Mm -hmm. So you guys need to find a, a 16th guy, which that isn't going to be hard with. <laughs> with no, no, I, I guess not. But. but for me, it sucks because that was a big opportunity, you know, and I was in strong style one and I probably wasn't ready. I'm yeah. fucking ready now. Well, I, I guess you were, before you got injured, you, I, so you went full time July. earlier than July, right? So, it'll be a year. By the time I come back, it'll have been a year since I went full time. And that's from this injury is literally fucked the second half of my first year of yeah. full time wrestling. Yeah, no, I, I I do understand that. But right, okay. So super strong style. Uh, we may as well now, considering when this is going out, we've already announced the Thunder Bastard. Uh, some, Seven men. Yeah, strangely, some people may have caught on the fact that there's somebody missing. Drop the bomb. Why is there seven men? In there's, well, there's seven men because obviously with your pec tear, you're not cleared to wrestle. Because I was booked to wrestle. Yes, because you were meant to be the eighth member of the Thunder Bastard match. Which obviously I know meant a lot to you because it's a, a chance at the, um, the Progress Wrestling Championship. It's, you know, there's, there's a lot riding on that for you and I know that, but... The thing is, Glenn, I can't wrestle. Super strong style. But I could wrestle someday. Could? Well, no. Well, I don't. Well, okay, your your interpretation. I, I could wrestle someday. You could. You guys see. Yes, I know. I, you, roll around, I know you I were rolling around yesterday. Yeah, yeah. I can right. fight. If I can fight, I can fight. I just don't think there's. There's a doctor in the world that would clear you to wrestle on something. But let's not worry about that. Let's worry about the fact that I'm telling you, as a man to a man, that I can wrestle this Sunday. And I've done the last 
Glenn. Okay. Glenn, Glenn, let me speak. All right. I quit my job back in July so that I could chase this dream and do this full time. Mm -hmm. That's all I've worked at and fought for for the last six months. I have a window of opportunity, which is this weekend. Post-surgery wrestling will not be an option. Prior to this weekend, it was all too sore, too tender. Wrestling was not an option. Mm -hmm. Surgery is March 5th. This is my last opportunity to do what I love. This is my last chance in my first calendar year as a full-time wrestler to lay spoons, walk out in front of an audience and perform black. I, it's not just the factor that it's my last opportunity, Glenn. It's also what it is. It's Thunder Bastard. It's a guaranteed title shot in progress. You understand how quickly this industry moves. Yeah. You get it. Mm -hmm. You understand that if I leave, when I leave, when I leave, yeah, because because I'm leaving the tap. Yeah. For three months, the whole industry moves forward, and I stay still. Can you tell me right now that I come back in July that you have plans for me for Wembley? No. Is there going to be any match not booked by July for September? Oh, the way we be the, way, the, way, the way that we book, no, if. that's highly unlikely. Exactly. Um, Okay, so I, 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 get, I get where you're coming from. If I win on Sunday, I call my shot right now. I won't just call my shot after I win. I'll call my shot before I even fight. If I win on Sunday, I cash in at Wembley Arena. And I'll give you the best fucking title match you've ever seen. And something, Glenn, you have an opportunity to give me something to make me wake up March 6th. Something to wake up March 7th, March 8th, to hit the gym, to stretch out, to rehab, to go to the doctors, to go to the chiropractor, to go to the physiotherapist. You give me a reason to live for those three months, Glenn. Something to get out of fucking bed for. You know, it, it's not just me though. Like this, this isn't, uh, it isn't a, it, like even- So take this video and show it to Jim. Take this video and show it to John. It's not just- As three men who run a promotion, which I've been in since chapter six, if you can't give me this, you understand this. One a, thing. You, you understand it's a medical and a legal thing. I'll well. sign fucking anything. Put the papers in front of me, I'll sign it. I don't even need to read it. If the papers mean I fight on Sunday, I'll sign it. I'll. I'm. I'm I can't. You know, you know, I'm not. I'm not going to say yes now. I'm not going to say yes. I'm not guaranteeing. I'm literally not guaranteeing you that we're going to say yes at all. I'll talk to them, but we need to, talk whether, to them. whether it needs to be on like talk this or... Them. Please show them this. Show them this. Okay. I do understand. I don't think, I don't understand. Please, from our side, we have a duty of care as well. We have to make sure that we protect the people. I can fight. I can fight. Alright. Okay. Can we cut there?